Welcome to the loop. show about video games and cowboys and aliens aliens mm -hmm. then they verse each other and james bond is there and harrison ford and han no, solo i mean indiana, indiana jones yeah sorry indiana I solo what about tom cruise can he be there no nope sorry Ooh, wrong you suck get our movie references yeah gosh Jeez, i've not even get seen it together that man i haven't either Cowboys versus Aliens, Jeremy. Haven't you seen the trailer for that terrible-looking movie? No. It's probably good, <laughs> okay. but I haven't. That's okay. Uh, of course you'd say that, Kyle. Welcome to The great. Loop. This is The Loop. It's a talk show about the video games. And my name is Eric, and as always, I'm joined by the curious Kyle. Hey, what's happening? <laughs> and the jovial Jeremy. That's me. And I don't the know. treacherous Trevor. Yep. And that's... <laughs> You know what? Once I heard that Trevor Ooh, you suck. got so mad at a person that he used a Taco Bell spork that he had just finished eating <laughs> off of to dig their eyeballs out of their face mm. in the restaurant. You know, actually, those... He leaped across the table mm. and he plucked both of their, their eyes out with a spork. That's like the perfect eye-plucking yeah, utensil. It is, yeah, it is. Because you, you get it in there. And, and should, the scoop. Yeah, yeah. I should know. Because I he did it. So, yeah, I mean, he would <laughs> so good call on your it's, choice. It's very use functional. Uh, I mean, it's terrifying. He seems mild mannered. Mm -hmm. It's also a great out. thing to use when camping. Mm -hmm. And also uh, for eye gouging. Even though he has the AIDS, Kuipers is here. Welcome. <laughs> welcome. Wait, you don't welcome. We were welcoming oh. you, Kuiper. Mm -hmm. Hello. Good grief. Are you okay, man? <laughs> I'm not no. sure. Hopefully that orange juice you brought helps your AIDS. Uh, so we're here to- We have to a pill now. <laughs> That's good. You didn't hear about that? Uh-huh. No, can take, I didn't. You can take a, a pre-activity um, pill. Mm. <laughs> it's to called the Magic Johnson. To help you- um, it's called the magic to, to help fight the chances of you. I don't want to know what HIV. shape those pills are in. Uh, are they gummy for them? No, I'm, oh. uh, it's it's a real thing. They do it just announced. It's a it's big a, deal. It's an AIDS pill, huh? It's a it's a it's like a AIDS prevention pill. It's probably the one that they've it's a, been it's an magic HIV pre prevention pill. Technically, mm. no, it's not. After you have AIDS, to help you regulate it, it's prior. It's to help you not get HIV. Really? So you're just like, well, I'm promiscuous. This is for me. Yeah, it's exactly. A new, it's a new daily vitamin. Yeah, it's like the before pill. Vitamin A H I V. Uh, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, vitamin anti H I V. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, it's supposed to keep you from getting it. Well, well now that we've well, made, you we've, know, maybe nurses that, and stuff that'd be helpful. Now, we've for now that we've spent we've and, spent all of our AIDS jokes for the entire year in this yep, one maybe, opening. Maybe we the should, next we should, five years. I mean, here <laughs> I was trying to have a real conversation. I'm sorry. It's a talk show about video games, not <clears throat> not serious <clears throat> matters. Chewable. That could be a tablets. Game. No, that'd be That's a game. Not a game. Tablets to, that you take no, before. No, never mind. I guess if it's somewhere where it's like a very prevalent problem and you're concerned <laughs> about it, you should probably take that pill. I guess. Oh, yeah. I thought you were meaning make I mean, a game. Uh, yeah, let's make a game. Uh, let's make a pill. game where yeah, you take a, a pill. take an HIV pill. That Here's could what be we're a, gonna do. A passive half clicker. Of you get a I would play that on my phone. And half of you get the real <laughs> pill. Oh gosh, that's terrible. <laughs> let's see you. I mean, if it was the '80s, it would be insensitive. But I feel like we have it kind of under control now. So I'm, you know, I don't. Yeah, Bono's on the job. Yeah, Bono's got it covered. Uh, you know, and the Angels. Um, this, this is a. Did I mention this was Dr. Yes, I ten think times. I, I think Maybe I a couple times. I think I keep trying to steer myself back on track as well you know, as everyone else. But when I, I just know. yank all of you off course, at this point, it's just should, tradition to start off topic and then yeah, go on. Yeah, well, that's pretty much how this works, right? Yeah. We just I talk agree. about things really that we want to talk about. <laughs> 
Last week it was, what was it? I don't remember even now. Stop trying to take us off topic, Trevor. We're yeah. talking about yeah. video games. I'm talking about the show now, so. Your name is Tough Topic, Trevor, not yeah. Off Topic, Trevor. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Either flows pretty well. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Tantalizing Topic, Trevor. Uh, Gross. Yes. That doesn't flow as well. Tantalizing <laughs> Topic, Trevor. Uh, As, never mind. There about, was other T words. I, I mean, it, I his grandma. Uh, what's her name? Is it is it is it Edna or Val? Shirley? No, that's his girlfriend. Well, or his girlfriend. That's what I meant to yeah, say. Not his yeah, grandma. Not his, his grandma. It's his grandma's his best grandma, friend. His girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think he. She calls him. Uh, titillating, Trevor. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. But mm-hmm. that's just I wasn't supposed to share. We'll that. let you. We'll let you guys out, figure yeah. that out. Uh-huh. Uh, but yeah, that's it's. You know, we're glad to be here. It feels for some reason. I think I, think I was talking to Kyle about this earlier today. I, it feels like it's been a while. I don't know. This this last few days has been a long week, like just a long time, like mm-hmm. since the last loop. Feels like forever. It's because we had snow and then we had seventy degree weather. And yeah, now we're and then the seasons have again. passed. Now we're gonna have snow <laughs> almost this weekend. full year. Oh mm-hmm. my gosh, I hate that. Yeah, I can't believe we're having snow again. I've got RPG this weekend. I can't have snow. Mm. <laughs> what do you mean? Ar- wait, wait, hang on. <laughs> RPG, so you can't you can't do that because of snow? No, I I can. You I will. Do you, yeah, I will brave or, the storm. Or you drive bar- barfing bath. You drive a There's Jeep two Wrangler. Terms for that. It's LARPG. Yeah, I, I'm not worried about my driving. I'm not an idiot, but other people are idiots on the road. Yeah, that's true. So, so, uh, idiots so do you I dress up about, in so. cosplay? No. <laughs> Why wouldn't that he's, add to it? He's talking about no. his RPG, you know, where people uh, yeah. come and to his I, house. I, yeah, but yeah, you I don't could all dress up, that. too. <laughs> yeah, it, why don't you is it always up? at your house, Trevor? No. Oh, okay. No, it's this one I go to is not always, never is at my, oh, okay. at my house. Okay. Um, mm. I would imagine that if you dressed up, it would make things feel more realistic. Mm. I don't really feel like dressing up. Like, let's see, what's my current character? A je- Jedi he's, master. He's a, a big demon man. <laughs> so just get some horns and call it a day. <laughs> that sounds expensive. <laughs> Mm, demon yeah. Trevor. I've already I've derailed us in a different way that, now. That's um, not expensive. I could totally make you some horns out of some. That's okay. I don't feel like no, driving. No, no, no. Out of paper it. towel yeah, roll uh, centers. Oh, gosh. I don't want to be, be you know, super easy. Penny. And then, penny uh, no, we'll, we'll spray paint it. It'll look uh, really cool. Penny, dime, <laughs> dime store dime demon. Store. <laughs> you don't trust dime me, do you? You're not crafty, demon. are you? Uh, I'm crafty. I don't. Uh, I just. I don't know. No one called you crafty, Trevor. All right, everybody. I want to welcome everyone. Because it's. There's no alliteration to that. <laughs> yeah. Traffic. Traffic. You're a Tragedy, Trevor. Uh, tragic, Trevor. <laughs> All right. Uh, welcome to the chat, Trevi91. I dislike hey. taxes. He says the trumpets are playing. He arrived. Ronan the Wanderer. I still know you're Snowflake. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you are. Thanks, everybody, for showing up. It's a lovely time we're about to have. Uh, and farewell to half baked Barracuda, who decided yeah, to come in. Yeah, we didn't want you to stick around anyway. Hey. Yeah, no. Well, that's, maybe thanks, he's still thanks, here. Thanks, half baked. Bye and bye. Maybe he just accidentally clicked out. Maybe he had to he's refresh. Like, yeah. Who are these guys? Yeah. Like, oh, wait. Uh, wait. Oh, I like them. Let me reload it. Oh, that you think baked. too highly. Yeah. Maybe his internet couldn't contain the awesomeness. That's you it. Know, I, I we, thought he had to get potato chips. We, uh, I, we entered a, a thing. Last Friday. Oh, yeah. Uh, How'd that go? Well, we haven't heard our, we haven't got the results back yet. But since we're a Twitch affiliate, which means we're not special enough to be a partner. Yeah, because um, there's not enough of you guys who like us. More special than just some average Joe. But, uh, Mm, (laughs) uh, Ronan, uh, Ronan the Wonder says, Did I miss a joke? I couldn't hear you over all this PC Master Race game you're not doing. Uh, Uh, wow, that's true. That was like, I, I, that's don't give him a comeback. You know, he's a snowflake. (laughs) Well, I know it's fine. I like the comebacks because I should probably just apologize to him right now. I'm really sorry, uh, for that time when Jeremy was streaming me. (laughs) Without my knowledge, and I was like talking about you. Was and that? Were we playing? I feel really bad. So, so we were, were playing we Sea of Thieves. I think you, didn't, I think you did. He, you didn't acknowledge it. It was just that it was like hours after. Yeah. So yeah. you had forgotten that of we course. were still streaming. Well, I, I mean, he, I, yeah. Well, no, because I think this was a separate occasion. No, it was the same night. So you. I you, think he. I maybe I think I thought he was yeah. done doing it. We or were something. streaming from Mixer, and yeah, I think he. It, it may have appeared like he had stopped, and he had. Well, we were talking about Fortnite, and I think Jeremy said, "Well, you know, Ronan says 
it, it, the, the, the shooting's better. Or no, 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 we're talking about the Sea of Thieves. And you said yeah. Ronan says the shooting's better on PC. Yeah. And I kind of made a smart out comment. Of course, mouse <laughs> and keyboard PC Master Race <laughs> always thinks that's better. And we were we were streaming, and I didn't know he heard that, and I felt kind of bad. Because, <laughs> you know, Jeremy's like the, you know, NSA, always just He's broadcast. always recording. <laughs> Yeah, I know. You said you prefer shooting on PC. You don't have to correct me. <laughs> yeah. That's it's, what I it's said. It's okay that you, hey. you know, <clears throat> as a snowflake. Remember that. I shoot on the PC <laughs> sometimes. Um, My problem is I go between them and like... Why is that a problem? No, no, it, it's it's not like... But like my problem is I get used to one of them and I'm terrible on the other one when I go to play oh. it. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, why did I ever do this? Yeah, I... I definitely prefer a controller, just in general. Like if I mean, like it if depends it, on the game. Yeah, it depends on the game. I, yeah. I sure I I play PUBG with a mouse and keyboard. Absolutely, yeah, because uh, it's better. Yeah, and I can't think of another game that I play with a mouse and keyboard. <laughs> Most first person oh. shooters, I would play rather play with a first person uh, or for the piece, mouse and keyboard. Yeah, so I, yeah. third person, I tend to go uh, controller. I've yeah. done PUBG, definitely better keyboard mouse. Fortnite. I actually like it on the key, on the controller. Mm-hmm. Even when I'm playing on Feels the PC, like it was kind of built even when for I'm that. playing yeah. on the PC, yeah. I connect the controller. Mm-hmm. I tried it with the keyboard and mouse. I just didn't feel as comfortable. And then uh, same Sea of Thieves prefer with the controller. Sea of Thieves just feels not, better a controller. Yeah, there's just not enough need for it's the keyboard less and mouse. Competitive, yeah. It, yeah. It the just, shooting it is better. Nice. Yeah, I guess, but I I don't know. I feel like. I better with the controller. If, if I'm playing a competitive I, multiplayer game, yeah. uh, I mean, I haven't played much Fortnite on PC, but other than that, like I go to mouse and keyboard because I know I'm going to get yeah. smoked. I've been doing crossplay oh, yeah, here yeah. quite a bit. Yeah. So, uh, which has been really smooth in yeah, Fortnite. Yeah, all that stuff works really well. Yeah. Anything that has driving, I typically prefer. Oh my gosh, driving with a mouse and keyboard is it feels oh, so a nightmare. Yeah. It's terrible. Mm-hmm. Uh, the only time I will ever possibly do it is if... Uh, if you can like shoot out the window, because sometimes the mouse and keyboard it feels more precise if you're able to aim. Half Life like, Two. Yeah. But, the uh, one thing I like is with the mouse uh, is games that allow me to adjust DPI on my mouse because I've got a gaming mouse. You've and got a so, gaming mouse. Yeah. So you can why do you preset what, games don't you don't what if you have a gaming mouse play? you don't need the game you to can, allow you to adjust yeah, the DPI. Yeah, you adjust you, it on the fly. Well, you just I adjust do, that's it on what the I mean. Fly, but there's some games it doesn't really matter. Is what I guess what I was trying to what? say. What it always matters. The speed it will change it matters, dramatically. Yeah. It matters for me, like like PUBG. It matters which gun I'm using. So I have different DPI settings per gun. The Logitech PUBG just actually, has a little yeah. up and down clicky thing on the side, and you just I, you can adjust it down. immediately. But if I can preset specific uh, weapons, oh, okay. I don't have to remember. You know, yeah. is that higher DPI, lower DPI? Like a just sniper, you want something a little slower, exactly. so you're not like yeah, you're not wandering as much. The screen. Yeah, yeah, no, that makes so. sense. And shotgun, you just want it like super responsive. Yeah. So. Um. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crazy legs, welcome to the chat. Good to have you here. Welcome. Uh. So yeah, that's that's uh, you know that, that's that's a, our PC Master Race minute. I'm glad everybody could tune into that and you know feel really yeah. feel really special. I I've honestly uh, moved a little bit away from PC games. It's an, like for one, I the when I first bought a PC. There was this shady website called CD Keys, okay? <laughs> Is it gone? And, and I would buy yes, a lot yes. of games on there for really cheap, like sometimes half off. Yeah. And now Smart. now it's like maybe $3 or $5 yeah. off for most of the games. Cuz they're going more legit. Yeah. Yeah, they probably got a little bit of trouble, but Uh yeah. So I just I the only time I do it is if I know I'm never going to play like a co- like multiplayer <laughs> with people that are on console mm. sure. or, or if it's for sure available on both. Well, Right, I mean, you're oh, crossplay. Yeah, you're yeah. always gonna yeah, buy yeah. Xbox I mean, games on yeah. PC, yeah. right? I mean, well, it doesn't matter. You as, get it, as, it as long as you buy matter. them digitally, yeah. you get them on both. So. Yeah, I'll agree actually, because I recently I've been buying games more for my console because it's nice being able to just sit down and chill in my out. chair, and it just works, right? So. Like, yeah. if I do that with my PC, armchair couch, yeah. I went to the effort of running a, an HDMI cable, like a hundred foot one, under in my basement from my PC <laughs> to my TV in the living room, yeah, and and it works great. But I still just don't want to have the hassle of fidgeting with big screen mode and Steam, yeah. and then like maybe it doesn't set up right, and then I got to yeah. get up and go over and tinker with it, and then go sit mm. back down. Where with with a console, there's just that certain. I, kind of just, I bought the HDMI works, cable you know. too. Mine's not nearly as long because it doesn't have to go as far. 
and I've plugged it in once. Yeah. <laughs> and I just, well, I was mine's like, always yeah. plugged in, so I don't well, have to worry about it. Yeah, but. exactly. I was going to say, that's what I've been saying for a long time. Yeah, I like I mean, being Kyber, able to Kyber. just... No, and I and I yeah. think I think I agree with that. I think it, the problem is there's just the there's, there's a lot of times where of yeah you can't sure. that's your only option. So sure, I will say I think I almost a little bit regret taking, getting Far Cry for my console, just because I think it might have been a little better on PC. I will say on the Xbox but, One X it does run pretty well. Yeah, but it's running well, all right like, on a regular <laughs> old PlayStation Four for me. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I bet it looks like garbage. Kyle. Yeah, probably <laughs> terrible. <laughs> it's, uh, uh, no, now, now it's it's uh, it's uh, first edition console peasants. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I know. Yeah. Oh, I've got a pro <laughs> and an X. The premium uh, editions. The, the funny thing is, like, I still expect the X to be 60 frames on everything, and it never. They're so oh, rare that the games yeah. are. I mean, some of the Microsoft first party stuff, they're like, okay, 4K 60, and that's cool. But yeah, they're just oh, not designed for it. I mean, it's. It's really cool, but I mean, it's. But then that's the thing is, like, you see a game on PC running in sixty frames, and you're just like, oh, maybe I should have played it. <laughs> it on looks PC. so nice. Yeah, it looks really, really pretty. <laughs> those those few extra, or actually twice. Doubt, yeah, yeah, twice as many frames <laughs> does make up a huge difference. Yeah. Um, and it's crazy with the Xbox One X, the way they built that like ventilation system and everything, like the cooling system. You'd think it could maybe handle. Yeah, it probably could more. handle it, but it's just yeah. Again, those games are just not designed for it. Well, I mean, they are, though, because they're running on PC, and they make the, like, well, specific versions. Yeah. But usually that just means, oh, here's, like, here's 50 more gigs of texture, you know? And it's well, like, yeah, yeah, but that's they typically the thing, though, cap them for, you're, for consoles. You don't have the ability to adjust what you care about. So <laughs> Sorry. So the, the quality of the picture is going to beat out the frames every time. On I, crazy uh, Legs just yeah. says, <laughs> Jeremy, tell us again how your HDMI cable isn't as long as Eric's. <laughs> Yeah. Oh man. Hey, uh, <laughs> how do you how do you say that? Traticus. 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 Traquitos. 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 Hey guys, he says. Hey, welcome. Hey, welcome to you. Traquitos, like you know, like the little rolls. Yeah, traquitos. No, I do cheese in the middle. Yeah. Sometimes they just have beef. Mm. I um, do like to keep dislike taxes. Everything. You're probably correct. Uh, <laughs> um, I, well. That needed de- that definitely needed to be said. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, I stopped myself from from starting Jeremy. to say it, and then uh, Jeremy, Jeremy I was trying just... to keep it family friendly. Jeremy, uh, I no, laughed. Some at cables it, but... have more insulation. Oh my gosh. Uh, anyways, <laughs> um, <laughs> he says I hate being right. <laughs> Oh, wow. Well, it's how you Nailed use it. the cable that matters. I mean, yeah. Are you stream- are you using it to put your PC on the TV? Obviously, oh, that's, Eric that's uses his use. more often than I do. Kudos yeah. to you. Mm-hmm. Well, you know. I don't I don't think I want to delve any further into this. <laughs> yeah, because he normally no plays it out, guys. The I mean, just are just tell me one more time, oh girl. I'd rather lie or die, girl. I, stop, no I can't time. stop it. Anyways, uh, <laughs> One more time. I think now it's the sense. return of trepidatious Trevor. Uh, we, you were here last week or so, but now what? you're back. Um, no, because oh, you don't want to talk yeah. about the cables. Uh, <laughs> yes, yeah. you're right. You're right. You know, I don't want to talk yeah. about yeah. the cables. Matter if you're a real audio and video file. Track Quitus says it's just my name jumbled up. All right. Well, that's cool. All right. We're happy with it. We're, we're glad yeah. you're here. So um, let's try to figure out what his name is with two Qs. I think his first name is Truck, Traku, <laughs> and his last name is Quetius. Uh huh. There mm. we did it. We solved this. We solved the, the mystery. mystery. Uh, Just like Mike Tyson. We're like the Mike Tyson mystery. No, crew. let's see. It's it's. Okay, stop. Yeah, you we're can't done. Just pause and be quiet <laughs> and stare we, at it's something. Trait while quits. We're... What have you been playing, Jeremy? Have you been uh, playing any video I've, games? I have been playing. Uh, quite a bit of Fortnite um, because my teenage daughter has now caught the bug. Like so, everyone else. Yeah, because it's Closing super Drake, popular now. So, playing it on, bar. so yeah. you've got to play it so that you can talk about it at school, right? Mm-hmm. So, Did you see that Drake wants to... to... No, Kyle, I was talking. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Go ahead. Just to, yeah, Kyle. No, you were talking. I did see that he said that he wants 
epic to put the hotline bling dance in the game. Nice. Yeah. yeah. And then he'll rap about it. Is that it. the one that yeah. everybody makes fun of? <laughs> yes. <Yeah>. The, uh, <laughs> you still call me on the cell phone. <laughs> bing, bing, do, do bing, 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 bing. The one that's the Nintendo. Nice. <laughs> the old Nintendo store mm-hmm. song. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the old Nintendo store music. That's right. <laughs> that's... Yeah. Uh, but anyways, you've been playing Fortnite on the PC yeah, yeah, and the I, Xbox. I finished uh, <laughs> Far it's a, Cry. It's a family Sweet. affair. Yeah. I just like Taxes says, Fall Guy has a family. He's shocked. <laughs> yep. Mind blown. Mind blown. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. know. We're, yeah. we're, we're all really rooting for him. I already him knew I was the old guy. Because mm-hmm. I yeah, had but he thought you were the old lonely guy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, yeah. He didn't know you had teenage. Yeah. Okay. Now he knows. Now he knows. Mm-hmm. Uh, anyway, so yeah, beat uh, beat Far Cry. Um, Real quick, TP Poker. Ask your question, please. Do he yeah. says hello? Ask I may ask a question. You may ask. A question. You just you just did. Yeah. Oh, he says his name is Titus for his first name. His second name is Trap, but with Q's instead of P's. Mm. So it's Trap Titus. But then he put it in the fancier way. Oh, cool. I like nice. that. I like, I like the name that. Titus. Yeah. That's a yeah. good name. Titus. He's my f- one of my favorite characters from Kimmy Schmidt. That's, That's right. a good show. Oh, I didn't even... Um, I, was, I more thought of... I think there's some major... Like some commander from uh, Warhammer. Star Citizen? No, Warhammer. Star Hammer 40K. 49. I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, that's a good game. We're going to talk a little more about yeah. Fortnite later. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, I've been and you beat getting, Far Cry. Yep. And uh, getting back into Sailing the Seas some Sailing more. some more Sea of Thieves. Yeah, I know. I saw you tweeting Thieves, anger so. about You know, some supposedly kind of they're beard. fixing the almond beard issues, which is their generic, our network sucks issue. But, you know. <laughs> Yeah. Um, you know, it's a game in early access, right? No. You know, another another game, uh, HQ, early had access. network it's problems a for a long time. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah HQ did a... That's, that's and I true. started a new game today. <laughs> I'm, so, so, I'm so glad at least one person is in my corner on that still. I felt so b- b- betrayed. Uh, <laughs> it's so funny you say that because I was totally ribbing Kyle today earlier via text message about it. Because he's like, did you see that The Rock's host is going to be three uh, 300,000? He said something about, are you going to are you gonna play HQ or something? like? That. I don't remember what you said. And, and I was like, like, no, because it's not I a game. I was like, play? How would I play a, ge- a thing that's not a game, Kyle? I might participate. <laughs> and, then I was just like, and then I realized, wow, that was really petty, Eric. You need to let it go. And, you and, need to I, let it go. and we didn't. We, I didn't say that it wasn't a game. I said it wasn't a video game. So there's there's the difference. Yeah, it's so. a game show. Obviously, yeah. that's mm. that's what the host himself calls Let's not it. Not go there again, guys. You don't want to do this. Read okay, the, well, a- hey, read the, hey, the we'll app go. description. Read the <laughs> app description. It Let's, says it okay, in hey. it. Shh. I okay. just know that got famous a video question. game websites <sighs> and video game journalists have referred to it as a video game. So TP Poker says, don't. my question is, what do you think of the current state of professional wrestling? And don't even think about saying you don't watch it. Thanks, and I love you. <laughs> okay. Well, First right. of all. So, Conor yep. McGregor is the greatest. That's not wrestling. In I'm the sorry, wrestling when ring WWF right now. had funny. to change to WWE, it, it oh. lost it for me, no, guys. You know what's funny about Kyle's, like, I'm pretending to know and I'm dumb about it, is that Ronda Rousey actually fought in WrestleMania this weekend. Well, and Brock Lesnar is... Uh, yeah, that's true. He's supposed he, to be going he back to the... Is he? Who I knows? Know. I just know he's in. I think he's try, they're trying to get him back into uh, the other one. The, the octagon. fighting. Yeah, I, know, I know that uh, Ric Flair is old. I would, I would just, a hot take? I, I would just say that the, the only thing I know about wrestling is that it it's it's getting better than it was like a couple years ago. That's all I know. Is people are enjoying it more. Yeah, well, that's I have a lot of nice. friends who like it. I I I love the games. I've never really watched the actual thing though. I'm sorry to. I couldn't. I could yeah. never get past the fact knowing that it was a it bunch was of not naked real. sweaty guys. It is real though, Kyle. So that was my. That I mean, was I'd my like thing. you. I'd like to see you do half the things that they oh do in that. Yeah, oh, no, I'm not saying that it doesn't do you, take talent. So you're the person who also doesn't watch uh, uh, gymnastics in the Olympics, right? Because that's what this is. <laughs> this is this is large men with muscles doing gymnastics together. No, that's it's different. Kyle's fetish. No, that's different. <laughs> that's exactly what it is. It, it is what it is, but it's different. He can't it's watch different it because Jeremy, it's, Jeremy, what do we say? Because it's not. 
Teenage Jer- girls. Jeremy, what did no. we say about bringing Kyle's kinks up in the show? <laughs> Um, oh sorry, gosh. It gets no, too personal. It's because it's, I mean, gymnastics, like, that's that's something that's real. That's not something this that they're... Her- that's not something that they are pretending to be doing something that is that is. When do they, they say are. they're pretending? They're acting. That's obvious. Everyone admits that they're acting. Well, yes. Because they're putting on a that show. That in and of itself is why I never was able to get into don't it. Don't get me wrong. I don't watch it either. I had the I illusion of it. thinking it was real. And as oh. soon as I realized it wasn't real... It was, it I, I had you. no interest in it at all. But I think that's, that's the way people would try to sell it to you as not being real. Like, cause I had that experience too when I was a kid. It was like, yeah. you realize this is fake. And then you're like, oh man, it's fake. Well, I don't want to watch this. This is dumb. But then like, yeah. as an as adult now, I feel like maybe I was betrayed cause I could have enjoyed it knowing that the athleticism is actually there because there's no I way agree. these guys could oh, not do this. Crazy. And stuff, like yeah. the, the, the parts that I, in, I mean, I, if Jerry I do Lawler, catch it, Jerry Lawler sent. Andy Kaufman to the hospital, so you still have yeah. the risk of injury. Oh gosh, of course. they still like, beat the crap out of each I mean, other. Yeah. you know, people get hurt, people die. They're like, yeah. what was yeah. that Japanese wrestler, the famous dude that died like a year or two ago um, from well, yeah, a I mean, you're driver or something. jumping around, throwing your body around, you know, all well, kinds of things. And a lot of the one things wrong they... move, and you know, yeah. you've given a guy a concussion. Yeah, a lot of oh, the things they absolutely. do require more like athleticism to so, not do what yeah, they look to, like they're doing. It's to, the choreography to be safe, is right? amazing. Yeah. To be safe and it's the choreography because yeah. it's, it's and I much I easier to punch somebody in the face than to I mean it's act not, like you're punching uh, somebody that, in the I face. I mean I don't like enjoy watching it personally, but the part that amazes me is that they can get in the ring and they didn't practice all their moves together. It's not like they spent weeks, you know, dancing basically. Doing the right? Doing dancing with yeah. the stars and getting the choreography down. They're so well you know versed of. in the mo- well. There are things that are planned, obviously. I'm sure but they rehearse, but, but, not, but there's yeah, so much there's good. so much ad lib that has to happen that they have to sense what the other person is expecting. It's really romantic, mm, sure. actually. It's like yeah, absolutely. I mean, <laughs> I think I'm in the same boat. For as one Eric. guy to go in for a pile driver, and the other guy to know that's what's going to happen, so he doesn't get hurt trying to do something different. That's pretty impressive. I love the fact that he's trying to talk us into this, and he, there's oh, I don't no watch way it that he would ever watch. <laughs> Jeremy, you want to watch? We should have watched. WrestleMania. I will laugh at it. Did absolutely. You know, that WrestleMania was seven hours long if you count the yeah, pre-show. I heard that. That's, that's what crazy yeah. to me. I don't have that much time. I tell I, you unless what. I'm playing a video game, I'll commit hours to that. We'll do that, yeah. and yeah. we'll go and we'll go on a motocross and um, tractor pull slash uh, monster truck rally weekend. Mm. We'll do all those things <laughs> together, and we'll be real bros. That's more oh, real gosh. red. You got to you got to also do the thing where you. Play tug of war with your trucks because Whoa. that's, cause that's super cool. I thought you were going somewhere. Hey, else. Titus, thanks for following thanks for us. Following we really right. appreciate hey, yeah, that. Thanks. Thank you. We tripped. Uh, so yeah, we oh. talked about some. He says <laughs> TP Poker says, uh, "Do you watch Game of Thrones?" That isn't real either. So there, yes. Kyle. Yeah. yeah, you're right. I'm a I'm a mm. huge hypocrite in that regard. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All of us agree. Someone yeah. cut that. I'm a huge hypocrite. Yeah. <laughs> Soundboard thing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Just push uh, the thing. Oh. Every time Kyle says something, oh, I'm a huge hypocrite. I just, I just push buttons. Why doesn't your iPad work? Oh. <laughs> um, Maybe you're just, oh. you're just pressing it wrong. You're I'm a vampire. Dead. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. It's. It, it, I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't really watch much wrestling, but I, you know, I appreciate it from a distance. Yeah, from a distance. I, I appreciate it now more than I the ever have. Wrestling looks. I just real. don't appreciate it enough to watch it. But and see, my my problem too is I kind of played the WWE games wrong because I don't know. Maybe this is just. Maybe I should admit this because you I, built all I, your I, professors in well, college oh, and and made too. them do a. Actually, I can't take credit for that. Cage. I was I was merely a part of that. I did not do all the work for it, but it was it was a great event though. You guys um, did sell tickets for that, right? Tell me you did. Oh, no, we didn't sell tickets. Oh, you should have. That was a missed opportunity. Was, yeah, to oh, have no one show bank, up. Yeah. <laughs> Just charge a dollar. We charge a dollar. Like That's why we charge for you guys to watch our show. Yeah. Wait. Oh, yeah. Charge a dollar or they get a can of soda. It's simple entry <laughs> fee. <laughs> it sounds like Ron Swanson. <laughs> See? So games. I uh, also checked out a new game today, but I think we're going to talk about it later, so I won't bring it up. What? Okay. What have you been playing, Eric? Thanks for yeah. bringing it up. <clears throat> yeah. I don't know. What have, was, that was what a weird has Trevor been playing? Uh, I, uh, well, I first I, I played a little bit of uh, Assassin's Creed Indica- Syndicate. Why? Because it's free, What's wrong right? with you? Because I, I, I don't know. I, I wanted to go back and finish that game. 
When there's Far Cry to play? Well, I don't know. I, I've i been sporadic with things. I don't know. It just sounded really fun, and so I wanted to do that. And then and you went back and played it, and I'm like, yeah. No, it actually, it felt great. It made me... I, I really kind of miss that combat, just because I like the new Assassin's Creed Origins. Yeah. But, like, the combat is... It's fun. It feels really good. It feels really... um. Like the difficulty's good, mm-hmm. but I just like the the <clears throat> the old one is just it's so stylish and it makes me feel really cool, and I yeah. like that a lot. Um, and Syndicate was just I don't know it was a really good game. Anyhow, yeah, I didn't I I play a little bit of it and it's it's fun. But I actually have been playing a decent amount of Star Citizen again. Um, <laughs> cue the eye rolls. But <laughs> how much was there, did you invest was there an article on the internet that told you you needed to play some more? No, they came out with a new update recently. Um, okay, that wasn't an article. That was a major did the, update. Did you have so. to pay for more? Did mm, you have to give them more money? No. <laughs> well, that's good. Every time you boot up Star Citizen, it charges yeah, yeah. your credit card. Did you card buy $10. another starship? No. <laughs> oh. Um, Can you buy a plunger for your toilet in your starship yet? No. Oh man. And if you'll let me continue from your. <laughs> Dumb. <laughs> just just go. Just yeah, go, go ahead. Kyle. Anyhow, yeah, I, it, the, actually, three point one is what just came out, and so it's it's a lot more stable, which is nice. And so I've been playing some, with some guys from uh, Guild I joined, and it's been it's been really cool because it's like I've just been flying these ships around, and it's just it feels really good, and it's starting to starting to take shape a bit more. There's still not much to do if you want something more structured, but there's it's just it's ju- just enjoyable just to be able to walk around your ship and do things and fly around and go land on a moon and ship fantasy. People, so it's fun. I don't know. It's that's what I've always wanted a game. And I've always been sad that I can't do that kind of stuff. Cause in most space games, you just, you're your ship. You're not anything else. Really. Mass effect. So mm. you can walk around your ship in that. Yeah. But it always felt a little, the same thing. Sol- with, you just let Seth green fly it though. <clears> yeah. <throat> it, well, Partly is yeah, not being able to fly it. Partly it is. It's always felt a little weird. I don't know. It, it felt disconnected. Like it wasn't like you were actually on your ship. It was like <laughs> I don't know. Crazy uh, Lake says, "Oh boy, here we go." BD, please dazzle us with your stories about how you clogged the toilet on your Millennium Enterprise thing. <laughs> thing um, ship. It's so <laughs> hey. enjoyable to walk around. Uh, yeah, anyways. <laughs> no, I, I've been having fun, though. It's, it's uh, cool. Titus says, do you guys remember the Mercenaries game? Oh, Absolutely. I love the Mercenaries Mercenaries game. 1s is the best. Mercenaries 2, they ruined it. I still love Mercenaries 2. And then too. they didn't make any good ones after that. But Fun fact, uh, Mercenaries 2 was kind of the game that got me into like looking and like following games in the game industry and stuff. Hmm. It I, was your gateway game. Yes, oh. it was my gateway game. Uh, yeah. I will forever mourn and love pandemic games i know so sad maybe thq nordic will buy them and then they can be pan thq (laughs) pandemic nordic uh i just feel like that's that would be their thing they could like bring it back i'm sure the rights are out there somewhere yeah they're doing that they're like rebrand they're like bringing back all the old thq games now because of oh yeah red faction i'm so excited yeah red faction's getting a a reboot or not a reboot a a remake remaster remaster yeah I'm hoping that means that another one's coming. <clears throat> Got to master it know. again. Yeah, but if there is another one coming out, it better be the good one and not the crappy one where you spend all the time underground and don't get to blow things up. That oh, was, right. oh, that's right. They did make another one. Yeah, the second one I was bad. Yeah, Gorilla uh, was so good. That Gorilla was, was awesome. Oh. I'd love that, that that you could just like blow everything up, and then you could like even kind of like uh, just go straight down through Mars and blow holes in Mars. What? Uh, well, that was awesome. that wasn't in that one. That was in the first two. You what? couldn't you couldn't blow up the ground in Gorilla. Oh, I thought you could in Red Fraction. That's the one where the buildings. Well, in, blow in up. Red Faction, the first one oh, in Gorilla, okay. Maybe you, couldn't, com- you could only blow up the buildings. I must be mixing the, the two up in my yeah. mind. But I, I loved the original one too. I didn't play much of the second one. <clears throat> but I think it was what was the third? Was it the third one then? That Gorilla was, was the third one. Yeah, and that was the one where you are on Mars and you can blow up the buildings. Nah, and you nah, 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 nah. What's the bad one then? Uh. What's the one where you're all on, are underground the 14. whole time? Fourteen. Armageddon oh, okay. was the one, okay, and yeah. that was the one where you could like blow things up, but then you had like a oh that's like right. a rebuilder gun. Yeah, thingy. that one was bad. Yeah. Um. But yeah, no, I, I, yeah, Mercenaries was Jeremy. You we played Mercenaries a bunch yeah. back in the day. That yeah, we was, did. Yeah, I, I remember that. that. That was fun. Uh, do you, I? What have you been playing, Kyle? Uh, just more Far Cry. Okay. Trying to get to that end game. 
you know, got to take down the father. Uh, I, yeah. I took down his his uh, his tower, not his tower, uh, the statue. Statue that was, that was fun. I did that too. That was an awesome. Yeah, I don't know if there was there a mission well, that you were supposed to do it because I yeah. just rolled up on it and I was just like, I'm gonna start shooting this thing. Yeah, there's, <laughs> there's, there's, that's what I like so about. Did you, not, that game. did you not do an actual mission where you had to go up and? No, I didn't have. I didn't ever have to because oh, I already did it. So, so I'll yeah. tell you how how I how I had it done in like ten seconds. Oh, okay. t- tell me you your threw ways. A bunch of bombs on Give it. me some hot I tips. I took my helicopter that had rockets. Oh, well, yeah. That's and I flew up to it, easy. shot it, landed the helicopter on top, and picked up the book. Yeah. See, I didn't even. Yeah. I flew I didn't a even plane. Think about and I landing I near it. the top. No, a bunch, and then I dove out and I shot all the guys. <laughs> and it was, uh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that I, I didn't even kill anybody other just, than blow up the I, yeah, statue. I gotta say, boring. Far Cry, Far Cry is awesome. Holy it's so cow. Good, that yeah. game is really good. I, I think the story is bad, but it's like such a forgivable thing because the game That's is so much fun. It, you know? yeah. 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 It's like, and even finishing the game, the story is still bad. Like, it's not, it's like Jeremy bad. and I were talking in Slack about like, well, should we spoil it tonight or talk about that? And we decided not to, but it's still like, I almost wanted to just say it really wouldn't matter because the But sto- that's Far it's Cry not- Endgame though. I, no, I feel like the other ones have been a little more interesting, though. Like, I yeah, feel but like they're three, all supposed to be kind of bad. I mean, four, four had a decent. definite like there was there were some there was like an aha moment mm-hmm. at the end of it that you were like, oh, okay, that's well, I think it did some like pretty interesting stuff character wise, just because you see what's his face go from this you know this this bro to this monster, <laughs> so that's kind of yeah. interesting. Yeah. But like, I think uh, there's <clears> some <throat> open ended things with the end game that I'm curious to see what. Any DLCs may... Oh, if they try to tie it up. There's... Well, there's... Hinting at a DLC... Well, they've already said they're going to go to... Uh, the the moon or Mars? Mm. Oh, yeah. In they've the got three Mars. different DLCs. Mars, and, zombies, uh, That zombies. makes sense after the ending. Well, exactly. Uh, uh, but we're, well, we're one of the much. endings. We're saying so much. One of Anyways, the, the, the thing about that game that I wanted to kind of bring up before we moved on was just that... it. I kind of hit on it a little bit last week about how you can kind of encounter those, the bunker, the prepper bunkers or prepper mm-hmm. stashes in kind of unique ways. Mm-hmm. But also, like, I was, I was, I read somewhere, or some, I saw someone say that, like, if you, you know how in the beginning it kind of leads you to the, the south, kind of the southwest. Yeah, it wants area, you to start the, there. They want you to start there. Someone was saying that they, they were like kind of on their way there, but then they just got distracted and were just like messing around a bunch and like got their what is the notoriety level or whatever that's called i don't remember what that's called you have a bar that fills up as you um as you liberate region, people. yeah your liberation yeah. bar yeah. or something mm-hmm. he said it got like way filled up before they even went to that town and they get a call on the radio and it's like hey uh you know you've just been doing a really great job and like you just inspired us all so much we went ahead and took the town back ourselves yeah <laughs> and it's like and there's it's a like, number of places in there that yeah. were just so you can really there's a couple things i did that it was like you know you did it backwards, right? Yeah, like, and they like joke about it. Like they told you, it. "Hey, yeah. wait a minute! Why didn't you talk to so and so to find the? You know, oh, you found this <laughs> without talking to so and so. Yeah, stuff like that. Yeah. yeah, I just think it's cool that it it lets you kind of circumvent its own mechanic or its own storytelling mm-hmm. mechanisms. But but also, I think then the argument to that is. Does it mean that none of it actually matters? You know what I mean. And I think ultimately the story doesn't matter because of anyways. Like it's just not that great. It's not. No. It's not. Yeah. That compelling. But yeah, you kind of. I don't know. It's just. It's a weird thing because it's such an open. In it's an open world game, but it it lets you go about it in such a unique way. Because like that's the other thing about like a lot of times like you imagine like a GTA or any type of other open world game. They still when, <clears> when, when you're very in linear storyline. Well, that, yeah, but You've I guess what I'm one saying main storyline thing to do. Yeah, but I, I guess what my point is is that y- when you do that, like you're playing a game, playing it, and they, you go into a mission, right? It's almost like they're shutting you off from all the side stuff, mm-hmm. and you can't even interact with that. Where this game, you could be in the middle of a side mission, you could be, you know, because like how many missions, Jeremy, did you have where someone was like, yeah, "I need you to get my truck. We, our family, oh, yeah. love that truck. Go yeah. steal that truck back." And it's like, okay, we're gonna there go. was actually that was one of them. People that, in Montana don't have this accent, but there whatever. Was, there I'll was go. one of those where I actually found <laughs> something. I can't. It wasn't a truck. I, it was the plane mm-hmm. where you're supposed to go get. I yeah. got the guy's plane before ever talking to him. Oh yeah, and it, over the radio, it's like, 
Hey, I see you got my plane from the, you know, from It's so guys. great that it lets you Can do you, that. That's I a, need that's, you to bring yeah. that over here. And then it actually, then it gave, like, a spot I had never been, which was where his airstrip was. Yeah. It had me go land it there. And I was like, and you oh, don't. I was just stealing this plane because was, I was right there in the open. Yeah. That's and so I thought crazy. it'd be fun to fly it. It's you know? cool it lets you do that. And I think yeah. that, yeah, but yes. then, but the thing is like, it'll, it'll let you like inner, you know, the little side things on the road where there's a hostage situation or something like that. Mm-hmm. And it'll let you kind of like just interact with that stuff when you're in the middle of following your mission, you can get out and save that person. <laughs> right. And then they can be like, thank you so much. And then run and like proceed to jump in that truck. That's a mission item that you need to yeah. return it and steal it. And like, no, drive away and you have to do it again. Uh, so it's just like stuff like that, that I did. I know it's very like, um, I don't know. In, in a way it's kind of endearing that they let that yeah. stuff happen. That's yeah. like, and it's just like, it's just a good sign of like good design and stuff. Yeah. And it's just, Emergence uh, and stuff like that. Yeah, Titus. Titus was asking, "Do you think Far Cry Primal ruined it? Ruined um, what? Far Cry? Ruined Far Cry? No, I don't no. think so. It was. I mean, it seems like they're trying to do something a little bit different with all of them and still keep them within that same vibe. Yeah. So that's that's what makes me wonder <clears throat> about the arcade in this one because it has elements from all the old Far Cry games and a few other. Uh, games in their ecosystem. Yeah, that you can you can use to build yeah. the levels. And they've also stated that they're going to add elements from the DLCs when those get released. So it, I tried playing some of that. I don't know if anyone else did much of the arcade. <coughs> it it was definitely a little rough. Yeah. Um, but that could just be with how early it is for okay. people to start creating. I know we talked about it earlier today, so I went yeah. home and played some tonight yeah. just before I came so I could kind of... <clears throat> And I was actually having a lot of fun with it. I don't know if it's just gotten better because See, people I played are it like day two. Yeah. So people are voting yeah, yeah. on this stuff, but it's just all it is is it's so you get like it's an arcade kind of because you get like one try at these things. So you yeah. can replay mm-hmm. them, but they throw you in there and you die. You have to start yeah. it over. You die. Yeah. You <clears throat> but the, they, I did this one trippy one that was like Alice in Wonderland or something. Weird. And it was like this building. You go in this building or a house, and it's like all right, get to the end. And everything starts to twist, and it's upside down, and then you're sideways, mm. and then by the end of it, you're walking up this like ramp made out of grandfather clocks, and then all these smaller clocks are like spiraling wow. around you, and you come out, and there's a giant clock in the middle of this abyss, and you jump <laughs> on it, and it's like, you have completed it. And there's like random cool. goats in there that I beat to death with a shovel. It nice. was great. Uh, so that, That's what it, I When I played it, I was just like, this could be really cool, but like I did it kind of day two as yeah. well, and so yeah. it was like... The thing that I was a little worried about is the level I played. One of the levels that was better I played, like the AI seemed really dumb. You I mean like know. in the rest of the game? <laughs> well, <laughs> like it's more good. dumb. Oh, okay. Like, I don't know. They seemed like they stood around a lot more than they do. Yeah, like, they were still run for cover and stuff. Yeah, there were a couple where I noticed that they were just like yeah. standing well, around. I think I what it does about. is gives a little bit of longevity to the game for a certain subset of players. And that would be people who have interest in maybe designing a level. Yeah. Um, and what, yeah. in turn, it gives a developer an opportunity uh, based on the voting system to maybe find, you know, some concepts oh, yeah. that they could pull into other games down the road. <laughs> so th- I think yeah. it's a unique way to kind of crowdsource that type of yeah. mm-hmm. experience. There's been other games that have had things like that where you could take and they've been, elements and they've build re- the- They've remade, remade like PUBG levels in it. Yeah, they've exactly. They've remade oh, like wow. other like famous yeah. like levels in it. So there's also one <laughs> it's level like Mario Maker for for this. Yeah. yeah, there's a level where it's just all it's the island of Fred Durst, and like he just comes at you and with guns, and it's just like hundreds of Fred Durst coming at what? you, and you have to kill them, and Who's, it's pretty funny. Which one's Fred Durst? Fred Durst is a, a, Limp Biscuit, a, a right? Yeah, the lead singer of Limp Bizkit. A oh, rapper okay. from like the nineties. I, yeah. <laughs> I did it all for the nookie. What the nookie? Oh, what the nookie? What? So what? you could take this cookie. Yeah. What? And stick it. <laughs> Anyone play the co-op? Fancy. Because I <clears throat> had no desire. I really no. want to, but I, I want to play it. Trevor yeah. will play it, okay? Because yeah. I want to do it. Because I think it could be yeah. really cool. I mean, I remember. I, I think now that I finished the story, I'm ready to do co-op. Because now it's okay. just like I. Just oh, now it's just her. blowing things up and screwing. Well, and there's there's some out. side stuff I I'd like to clean. Or I'd even play. I don't care which we can. The thing that I that limited me from wanting to do it initially is because it doesn't save. So if I were to play with you, yeah, I'm you're only, only gain, helping him. I'm only you're helping you. I'm not getting any of that progress, which well, really was annoying. You got yeah some of like the like <clears> any money yeah. and stuff towards perks. 
Yeah, you, you get all that stuff. Yeah. See, the funny but, thing is, yeah. I'd almost rather not get progress in the game because I, it's like I almost think I'd rather do thing, some things myself. I'd almost, I'd rather have you know. Oh, you yeah, rather join somebody I don't want to go back and, and then, do it again. Yeah, yeah that's, that's my, the thing. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. a lot of those things are so they're not the story missions are not that great. There's yeah. a couple, and none of you guys want to play a few that are okay. one of those yeah. with me that I've already played. I know that. Why? Because I will just be like, we have to do it this way, guys. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. I mean, yeah, so course. I hey, know go better. Look over there in that corner, underneath uh, this, you know, this very thing that no one else ever will look in. Uh, you'll find a box full of yeah. money. It's a prepper and stash you didn't know about. Yeah, that yeah. you would have never found if All you were playing books. with me, Jeremy. <clears throat> yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Kuipers, have you been playing Far Cry at all? Yeah, I have been a little bit actually. What do you think of it? What's your verdict? Um, I've been liking it so far. Cool. Boomer is my, probably my best friend right now. Oh, Boomer's, Boomer's great. Awesome. Yeah. He, I mean, he is just D-Dog, but still, it's fine. We <laughs> need more D-Dog. He's not as good as D-Dog. No, D-Dog uh, is way better. Yeah, I'll, I agree. I'll, 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 argue, I'll argue. I'm running around with Cheeseburger Oh, Cheeseburger is the great. Cheese, well, peaches cheeseburger is pretty peaches, amazing. The two of them, I'm, un, I'm I feel like I'm unstoppable. As soon as anything starts to turn See? sideways, those two just go at everybody, and I only have to do half the work. And That's, I think they're I both it. stealth. No, no, Cheeseburger is no, not heavy. Yeah, yeah. Not stealth but, at all, but yeah. no, but uh, as long as you're stealth. not seen, yeah. they yeah. they can go wreck oh, an yeah. area and it doesn't impact you. It doesn't you. impact well, you, yeah. Whereas a person would. Right. It sets off the alarms. I right. find I don't actually like using the characters just because they do make it so easy. Because I'm just like, well, it's it's not even about easy. It's like, I want to kill them myself. I don't want... I don't want these guys to kill everybody, and then I'm just like, I didn't even get to do anything. Yeah, yeah. I liked just, having the guy who flew the pl- flew. He the was plane helpful sometimes. Yeah. Because and and I would have to pick certain times because other times he'd just do a bombing run. <laughs> what, and what and I'm yeah. like, what are you doing? I was trying to be stealthful. <laughs> Which the, so yeah. I'd send him on a mission Closer. like way out of the map. I just like mm-hmm. push him. Here, go look over there, and he'd be like, "There's nothing over here. I don't know what you're calling here to do. <laughs> what's, yeah. what's wrong with you?" Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, uh, I, and that's why I think I really enjoy playing it with cheeseburger and peaches because they don't set off alarms the same way yeah. that people do, and they even if they do go rogue, it still doesn't ruin what I'm trying yeah. to do. Yeah. So, and most of the time they don't go rogue. If anything, I'll have these occasional moments where I'm like, why do I suddenly only have one here and the other one is not like responding or anything? What the heck? But. Uh, no, those those two are my favorite because it's just it's like having this giant ant. And uh, plus, if you're running through the wild and a bear happens upon you or a cougar happens upon you, it doesn't stick around for very long. As soon <laughs> oh, as it gosh. sees that you've got a bear and a cougar hanging out with you, do you get the perk that they avoid you? I don't think I've gotten that one. Where the cougars... <laughs> it's funny because then they'll just attack the NPCs and you'll just be having a chat with them in a story thing and be like, blah, 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 and then... <laughs> and then they're just gone and you're like, what are you doing? <laughs> Whoops. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, but I think the... The other thing about the stealth thing is it feels like the, the silencers are kind of useless in that game because you shoot somebody with one and then they're all alerted anyways. And it yeah, kinda, I never had that problem. No, Every not time as I use the sniper, they, what, I do. Yeah, the only sniper if there's, rifle. Only if they're in an area where they could be seen. Yeah, I feel like everywhere they're seen. I don't know. Maybe I'm just I, doing actually, it bad. If they're, I've not had that problem at yeah, all. Yeah, if they're I, separated out, the one the one complaint Every time I, I shoot is, one on the roof with a sniper, everybody around him sees it, and then I, they're all I yeah, like oh, shooting two people yeah. who are who are in line with the shot. Oh, it goes for both of them, I know. Isn't that yeah. cool? Yeah, yeah I'll do the 50 yeah. cal which, which, silence, yeah. and it'll just go right through them both. And kill them both. Yeah. I tried cool. using uh, Jacob's, uh, I think it's Jacob's, uh, mm-hmm. sniper rifle that you get after you, you take him down and it doesn't give you any option to put a s- silencer on it and your scope mm-hmm. isn't as good so it's yeah, like you can't customize yeah. those weapons it's, it's oh. more powerful and it definitely was like whoa I feel but there's like a- way more boss with this thing but it, there's no stealth to it and I can't see as far with but it but there's a version so just, of that gun that's not yeah, you the can branded buy it and one and that it. you can't okay yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm just, I just realized we like I asked Kuipers and then we just shut yeah, him down I, immediately. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Kuipers, did you have anything else to add? I apologize. Um, not really. Other than I just really like petting Boomer too when he does a good job. He's the um, cutest yeah. he video game puppy. Good boy. Hey, buddy. Good boy. He's like, oh, hey, you killed those guys. Right. Sweet. Good Thanks, job. Buddy. You're a good murdering dog. Yep. Uh, yeah. Yeah. One other question that I did have that I wanted to circle back to here. Uh, what path did you go? You were talking about how you know you're kind of pushed into that southwest area to start the game. 
Did you? I just worked of... counterclockwise from there. Okay, so you went. I to think the that's bottom the way they one and then go. the top one, and yeah. then finishing yeah. with, right? with I think the, that's, the daughter. I think that's how they push the storyline. Yeah, I don't okay. know. The one thing I noticed is like those, you know, the missions. Like as you know, you get kidnapped all the time. Yeah. Jeremy hated that, <laughs> but I feel like when you're with um, Faith. There's no like real gameplay to those ones. Like when you get kidnapped, you just kind of yeah. wander through the bliss, and then yeah, like something kind of happens, yep. and then it's over. That's it. There's no like combat yeah. or anything until like the final one, and it's just it's kind of a weird. Well, and I've only done <clears throat> hers and what's his the bottom left guy, but her stuff has been by far even more boring than what's his face's. Yes, and I'm just like, oh gosh, can this just be done? I just want to go kill people. There's, there's like so much yeah. that I want to still talk about, and I feel like we're not going to get to our topic. But yeah. I have to. I would be remiss if I did not mention oh, the soundtrack. Uh, so we talked about it a little bit last week. Now and then, like more was uncovered, right? So I was yeah. commenting on how creepy I thought the soundtrack was. Yeah. Kyle tweets out the soundtrack, kind of, I think, half jokingly at the time, maybe t- on it Twitter. Was, yeah. And because and you'd been talking about yeah. it, so I was like, "Hey, if you want that worship album, here yeah. you go." So I, I download Eden's the Gate. cult worship music. <laughs> and I listened to it, and I'm listening to it. And I was just kind of like sitting at work listening to the cultist music. Oh, no. <laughs> and I'm like, this is really, really good. Like, what the heck? <laughs> this is really good. And so I tweet Kyle. I'm like, I don't know. Out of the context of the game, it's actually really good. Like, And, and he goes, yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. And so I started digging, and I found out, okay, so Dan, somebody made the – um, made the sound like the actual orchestrated soundtrack of the yeah, game, right? Like the I, music. The music yeah. is really good. Is really good too in, in general. But then he must have written the songs. But the ones you hear on the radio in the game are the choral versions that are this choir singing them, and they're creepy as heck. But there's like <laughs> there's funny. like this other version of the album called Into the Flames that you can get in Apple Music. That's like a folk. Kind of countryish, kind of good. Really, really good version of these songs, and wow. it's like very enjoyable to listen to. So, so uh, there's there's the original soundtrack. Yeah, there's like three, then four there's soundtracks. The, then there's the the stuff that's the the really good version of it it's called, called Into, Into the, the Flames. Flames. Yeah, that's by the same guy that did the the score. Mm-hmm. Um, and then there's two other versions of Into the Flames. One that is it's um, called We Will Rise Again. Reinterpretation. And that's just instrumental it's, versions of those. Is cor- that one just song- instrumental? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then the other one is the the uh, Hope County Choir, which and that is just one is the, the choir version. And it's terrifying because the melodies are just a little off because they're more generic for the choir to sing them. And there's a lot of reverb and it's just like creepy. But I'm not kidding. Go listen to, is this the good version? This is uh, the Into the Flames? No, this is on the, uh, this is the, the choir version. Okay. Play uh play Brother John or whatever the one is not Brother oh, John. John Oh John, yeah, play yeah, Oh John. That's this one. Okay. So this is the creepy version. Okay. So the songs get stuck in your head because they're all kind of earworms. But now listen to this song, like this more like folk version of it of Oh John. And it's actually really, really good. Definitely different. Yeah. Okay, it's it is right. really kind of eerie. Now, though, yeah. Listen to like, yeah. listen to uh, play. Wait, 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 I gotta find this other one. Where's it at? Nope. <laughs> they're, they're, wait. What was? That? Hold on. Nope. I'm gonna find it. Cause. This is where we where we find it. <laughs> yeah. I think this is one of this is it. The rifle gun, the rifle song. This is Jeremy's song, by the way. Uh, that's actually kind of good, really. It's yeah. really good. <laughs> I'd feel really weird listening to it because it's like this weird. That's that's actually really. Good it, though, it's. Yeah. I would encourage everyone if you've got like a free streaming service, listen to the Into the Flames soundtrack yeah. of Far Cry Five. It, it kind of makes you wonder why that isn't available in yeah. the game. I think, it, and I think they like did it. I, I mean, think I think they got, want the tone of it to be a little more eerie, and yeah. I think that's probably why they did that. Yeah, but, but you know what I mean, like where you could like listen to it through yeah, the start menu or something. That version you know I mean? doesn't mix with the game. Yeah, the, it does. The that's creepier true. one. It's like Jolliver said, super good. Colts. <laughs> yeah. Or, or no, what if what if what if it was like 
some guy on his porch that you just happen to drive by yeah. in the game is just, just playing, playing his yeah. guitar yeah. and that's him singing uh, there was a, in the game. Th- have, did you notice how many outposts, I think it was because I was playing it after listening to it, how many outposts have dudes that are just singing these songs to I, themselves? Yeah, I love yeah. that they do that. <laughs> well, I, like, I like it because like they'll have like they'll be playing the song with the loudspeaker and some of the guys will be singing. Yeah. And it's yeah. just like that's super cool that they do that. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah like, because shoot to be in indoctrinated <laughs> into the coat, you need to f- <laughs> fall in love with the music obviously <laughs> no it's just cool because it's like you totally i mean these these crazy cult guys would totally do this you know the music's playing all the time I, I i was saying i think i was creeping my wife out because i was like after playing this game and recently watching waco the miniseries on yeah. paramount about david koresh uh i was like i think i want to start a cult <laughs> this sounds like fun welcome uh, to the <laughs> yeah, brothers. So it's just like all right, we're gonna start pro- like we're gonna start making our own music and it's we're gonna have a cult it's gonna be fun can we is that against the terms of service on twitch is it? i don't know uh, welcome I, welcome uh, to the church of the why tub would it be? i need to get some cult glasses yeah, i was gonna say are you gonna get those yellow shades the yellow maybe shades. not uh, maybe not yellow but i could get like prescription wireframe ones i'll just uh, look like a cool hipster go. preacher uh welcome to the chat um, strike manta uh, he says, finally, a show where the hosts have a ton of sexual chemistry with each other. Yeah, we haven't, right. we haven't even got to the, we haven't got to the part where we yeah. make out with yeah. each other. Yeah. That's coming later. Yeah. 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 We keep our mm-hmm. shirts on, though. Uh-huh. Or oh, at least our pasties. Jolliver says, cult of pelicans. I don't even know if we talk. Do we hit the topic tonight, guys? I no. feel like we already oh, like, talked the show. Yeah, this is, I mean, I mean. I don't think we have time. Yeah. We could mention there's this new game out that people should check out. Well, well uh, Jeremy, you set it up earlier. Well, okay, real quick. Yeah. I just, I'll set this up real quick. Is What we were going to discuss, which we ran out of time Maybe tonight. we'll just have to do it next week. Uh, we can, maybe we can do maybe. it next it'll week. Probably it'll probably still carry be a topic. Over. Yeah. Uh, but we'll probably talk about it next week then. Uh, but we were kind of going to talk about Battlegrounds versus... Uh, uh, a Fortnite and kind of the differences, which one we thought was better, um, and and that sort of thing. But uh, it, but, it, but all this was kind of spurred because of um, Cliff UB's new oh, game, yeah, uh, Radical Heights. And, Radical and Jeremy Heights. was playing it. You said you got a chance to play it a little I bit today. Played probably maybe three hours actually. Really? Okay. Yeah. Um, it's got it's an early, it's, early access. Er, yeah, they call it Extreme Access. Okay. Is actually how it's titled. <laughs> uh, available on Steam. Uh, came out yesterday. Um, five months in development, so they are very honest about how raw it is. Uh, but it's got some unique features, uh, some major ones. Instead of a, a cloud that shrinks in a circle the entire time to a you know, single spot like the other two games, uh, this one breaks up into square segments, and they aren't always centralized. Yeah, Trevor said they kind of snake so, around. Sometimes. Yeah, so you could have yeah. a block right in the middle that is a no-go zone, and you have to find your way around it f- through areas that are. So it can be spotty, and it changes. Um, and at the very, very, very end, top 10 play, basically, it'll go to a like a, a, a zone that everyone has a has certain amount of time, no matter where they are on the map, to get to, and then they have to stay within that zone to win. So that's how they kind of still oh, focus okay. it. But it's got some unique elements around uh, a money system in game with an ATM system where you can cash out that money before yeah. you die, so you can use it later to buy a better gun for a, a later. Um, so it's got some interesting gameplay. twists on it. It's got a bicycle race in the middle of the game that if you grab a bike at the beginning and go to the start point before the timer clicks off, you have to race your bike bike to a finishing point. And then you get special armor and gear. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, that's cool yeah. While people are trying to shoot it. You know, so everyone's <laughs> yeah. shooting and you're just on your bike trying to do this race. And everyone knows where the race starts because it showcases it. Okay. Um, so, yeah, there's some really unique elements in it. Um, I'm excited to see where it goes, to be honest. And it's just interesting because I think this is uh, this is the, the what was the, bull, not bull, Boss Storm. Team. Uh, lawbreakers, yeah, lawbreakers, Law yeah, yeah. Uh, lawbreakers creators. The Bosky, yeah, that's the name of the developers. Now, this is Cliffy B's company. He, mm-hmm. and if you're not familiar, he was with Epic first. You know, he was way back in the Unreal Tournament days. You know, Gears of War. Right. He's responsible for um, a lot of those games, and so like he left to do Bosky. And I mean, they made um, like Lawbreakers, which is such a generic name, I always forget it. Uh, <laughs> but they and and it and it just bombed. I mean, I even yeah. there's a fake. Uh, what was his name? Haas, the guy that used to be Sony's uh, president, or Haas Kuru. Uh, he's a Japanese dude, and I can't pronounce his name. Well, do you know what I'm talking about, Trevor? Uh, uh, he, no. uh, anyways, there's a fake account for him where, and it's like a it's a parody account where they tweet funny things. Anyways, he says <laughs> he said they tweeted out today. Uh, Lawbreakers started out with a hundred players. 
uh, but now it just has one. Uh, <laughs> and so, like, he was That's almost, funny. like, making a pun on the, like, Battle Royale thing. I will say, too, one other thing about the game is it's, uh, it's, it's, the story behind it is, uh, for people who have come back from war, don't feel like they belong. There's like this whole commercial at the beginning of it, and it's like oh, a game creepy. show. It's a game show based in the '80s. Okay. Uh, where basically, uh, they go there knowing that they're either going to die or win a bunch of money. Oh. Okay. So, um, yeah. Because that money will fix all their problems. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds exactly. Like, that sounds okay. Coming, but, from, coming back from war. Okay. So it's, let's ignore this story because it sounds very bad. Uh, yeah, it's and, terrible and really gross. But, but anyway, um, the '80s, the '80s styled game show thing has its own cool. unique spin. I think so. Uh, all right, check that out on PC. Yeah. I'm sure it'll be popping up later once it becomes the most popular game ever. Yeah, uh, <laughs> to surpass Fortnite soon. Um, yeah. Fortnite is just out of hand. I Fortnite's going to add ATMs. Ref. I know it's going to happen. Oh, ATMs, soon, yeah. really? Yep, they're going to do well, a money system. They've got to do well, it after playing this game. I'm telling you. I bet they'll do the the anyway. weird grid thing too. Yeah. Uh, you can always be sure to email us. You know, if you have a topic you'd like to talk to us about, you can email us at uh, tub. Or no, this is the loop. So the loop at minutetub dot com. <laughs> you can call us at four seven five tub call. Uh, leave us a voicemail or you know, shoot us an email if there's a topic you'd like us to discuss, to discuss and then ignore by talking about the other things we want to talk about for a full hour. Uh, yeah. we can, yeah, there's well, good we can games out. What are we going to do? You know, I, um, think, I think it would probably be uh, something that would help incentivize us to, to stay on topic if, no, we, that's do, true. if we actually had somebody submitting. <laughs> yeah. If we knew you oh, cared. We'd, we'd, talk about it. Oh. we'd be like, this um, person wants us to talk about Tell us thing. what you would like from this tub cult that we're creating. Yes. What would you want? What would you yeah. want there to be in the cult? What uh, can the fathers do for you? Oh yes, we are all the fathers. <laughs> Wait, which one of us is? Which one of us is Kyle? The father. Kyle. And if you don't know, Jacob. It's not you. The faith. <laughs> <laughs> I'm faith. <laughs> yes. Okay. Good. Can I get you to wear? Kuipers, but can I get know. you to wear a pretty little dress? And, <laughs> yep. you know, and no, Kuipers isn't. One sell of me them. drugs. No. Uh, there's, uh, there's three, and I'm then the father. And there's th- he's cheeseburger. He says. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. Uh, yeah. Just get him. Just get him some salmon, and he'll be happy. But so. I feel bad for you because cheeseburger has diabetes. Uh, <laughs> don't feed him. An just don't feed him an actual cheeseburger. <laughs> yeah, I love that part when they're like, "All right, now I know his name's cheeseburger. Don't feed him cheeseburger. He got the diabetes." They remind you of that all the time. Uh, uh, anyways, yeah, send us a topic if you'd like. Uh, but you know, we can never end a show. Without thanking the real heroes, uh, that's the Patreon peeps. Uh, we love you, ladies and gentlemen, who support this show on a monthly basis. Money makes a transaction from your bank account to ours, uh, and it's incredibly, you know, gracious of you. I'll say yes. that. It's thoughtful, it's nice, and we appreciate it. Uh, and these names you see in Shining Patreon Coral are our co producers or higher. That means they donate $10 or more every month. They're famous because their their names are on this Twitch channel. So you too can be famous by going to patreon.com slash minitub and subscribing at one of our very, you know, tempting levels between $1 and whatever you want to give us a month, whatever you can afford. Uh, really, it's, you know, it's, it's just to further our cause and our cult. Uh, so um, <laughs> I appreciate that. We all appreciate that. Yeah. So f- feel free to pat yourselves on the back if you are one of those mm-hmm. fine people who donate, no matter what it is. Um, yeah. But I think that about wraps things up. Uh, I got to check. I heard that. I don't know if you guys saw in the chat earlier. Crazy Legs has its own streaming service. So I got to check that out. Oh. Uh, Wait, so, what was it? Uh, I, think I missed it, it. I think you said it was a schlong. Uh, oh, so, um, yeah. Yeah, that one. <laughs> uh, but anyways. Yeah, it's um, where you can do really uh, long Jeremy, streams. Yeah, that's exactly right. Yeah. Send Jeremy a link to that, yeah, please. Or really. There's no data caps. Yeah, no data uh, caps. You can check that out and more things later, I guess. No, but uh, join us tomorrow night uh, when we will be back with the Tubcast and... Uh, Kyle, are you going to play the music? Or yeah, you're just, I mean, yeah. I think we're going to talk about some current it's events. It's going to be playing. fun. No, it? I, it's not actually playing yet. I haven't oh. pressed play. Oh, okay. Sorry. Oh, wait. You were still, I don't yeah, know. Anytime. No, I was just whenever we you want. Just, yeah. All right, everybody. Like I said, you can join us tomorrow night for the Tubcast. What happens if I stop? The and then I stop talking. So, you. <laughs> <laughs> what power you haven't given him? You can join us for the Tubcast tomorrow night. That. <laughs> 
It's at 9 p.m. Central Standard Time. As always, you will join us. We'll be here at 9 p.m. 9 p.m. Central. Uh, no. <laughs> Let's start that over again. you got to start that over again. <laughs> All right. Thanks again for watching. You can join us tomorrow night at 9 p.m. Central Standard Time here on twitch.tv slash men in a tub. We will be here with the Tubcast. Uh, and tomorrow night, just a little tease. I think we're going to be talking about the Zucky mm -hmm. and the, the face Zucky. and the face bookie. Uh, that's going to be our topic tomorrow night. If we get to it, who knows? <laughs> Maybe we'll chat about Power Rangers. Do you for like an us hour. talking about topics? Do you like us talking about Power Rangers for an hour? I don't know. Let us know. It, it, you never know what we might. What yeah, Power Rangers might talk about. are pretty cool. Yeah. All right, everybody. Get your booster seats ready. <laughs> Not. I mean, there was that one crossover with the Ninja Turtles and the Power Rangers. That was oh, really what? cool. I mean, it wasn't as cool as Scooby Doo and Batman, but it was still Power really Ranger cool. Turtles crossed over with Batman 2 one time. Hey, I, you know what I saw? Hound Puppies. I saw Black Panther finally. I'm going to have to talk about that tomorrow oh. night. I hadn't seen it yet. High five. High five.